Hi guys, this is Jane. I'm here today to share with you um, some tips on bathroom renovation in an old, old bathroom, 35 years old, and specifically today it's with regards to removing tub drain, which many people find frustrating and including myself, which I attempted today, and I thought I'd share with you my uh, failures and successes. Um, and obviously the end result being the success, which is what you'd like to hear. There isn't really anything on YouTube that, um, well, for me, that I found uh, helpful um, or worked. There are some things that may be assisted in the outcome, but uh, overall um, there isn't anything uh, there or what I came up with, as far as I can tell, um, that actually worked. So if you're frustrated like me and have been working on trying to remove this stubborn tub drain, this piece right here, um, out of your tub, backing it out, out, um, and you haven't had any luck and you've looked at all the different techniques, um, I'm here to share with you one that worked for me today. Um, as you can see, that we're ripping out the entire tub because uh, it's a beautiful blue, and we want to get rid of that. So some of the things that I did come across online um, that I tried was, and it may have assisted somewhat, was uh, the WD-40. Uh, initially, I don't know how much it worked, but uh, near the end it may have helped a bit. Um, one thing that I don't think worked at all was the hair dryer uh, method, which apparently you're supposed to use, um, and when you have the flashing piece on, it's supposed to uh, heat up this piece under and, and the plumber's tape underneath, and then, you know, you're supposed to be able to twist it off. Um, but as you uh, probably are aware of, um, when you're attempting this, looking inside, this is the piece obviously you're trying to remove, um, there's generally little two little crossbars in there um, that when you use certain tools, uh, you can butt up against and, and use that as an anchor in, in, in hopes of twisting this around and removing it out. Well, of course, that didn't work for me. It may have assisted a little bit, uh, maybe in loosening it up, but to be quite frank, I, I really don't think it did. Um, so the initial thing uh, was pretending that the flashing is still in there, is that the idea is that you put a pair of pliers in as such, and then you take a bigger pair like this, and you put it over, and basically this anchor is up against those two little crossbars, and you... You use this and you, you twist and twist and twist. It's very, very hard. Uh, you're supposed to go slowly so that you don't break the drain. And that is supposed to eventually um, start moving moving the, this piece around. Well, I've tried this and I continued to try it for probably, well, it seemed like an hour and I was getting extremely frustrated. Um, every once in a while I'd take the WD-40 and I'd spray it around and, you know, uh, but anyway, it didn't seem to work. Uh, so bashing my head against the wall, I walked away and thought, well, you know, what am I going to try now? Anyway, so I came back and what I did was I, obviously this is still in place. I got my flathead screwdriver and a heavy duty hammer. And what I started to do was I, I mean, this was in there pretty good. I just kind of got an, an edge there and I just started hammering and lifting hammering and lifting so that eventually I got a lip on the flashing and so what that did was it acted like an anchor and I was able to take my pliers and I started you know ha having something to hold on to and t started twisting it did take me a little bit to get it going so you could do it that way and then obviously if you're you can't get it all the way around the tub because there's not enough room so at least then when you've got the lip on there you can then obviously take your pliers and go above it as well and keep going that way and then back down and you move it around so that eventually it starts moving and twisting and then you can take a little bit more WD-40 and spray it around and then eventually ta-da it came out oh my goodness it was just I was elated. <laughs> um, it actually worked. So uh, I know there's people out there frustrated and they're, they've gone on YouTube and they've looked for different ways and methods of taking this, this drain out. Because obviously you're not going anywhere until you detach this piece and this piece and then you can take out your tub. Um, so give this a try. It actually really worked. Um, so uh, don't get too frustrated. 
hopefully you'll find this video uh, a lot sooner uh, than an hour after you've been trying like I did and, and give it a shot. It, it does work, guys. So there you go. Good luck with your renos.